At the present time, I probably own $25. When I go hunting, take 10 of them hunting, the other ones will bark some. When I go to feed them in the evenings, they will all bark. Other than that, if a bear or deer comes through my yard, they will bark at me. I've lived there since 1975. I moved out of Hillsboro on account of this same problem we're talking about now and bought the place at Mill Point, and I lived beside Ed Riley, Sam Arbigas, and B. Rose, which is all farmers. Two weeks ago, they sold their calves. There was 100 cows on each side of my house, running the fence, bellowing and bawling all night long. I never made no phone calls. I never complained about it, you know? And it's like Mr. Zorn talking about his place, you know, losing some business, you know? That's why most of us are selected to live here in Pocahontas County. And when people come to my house, I tell them up front, hey, I got 25 dogs out there. If you can't stand to hear a dog bark, you better not sit down and eat meal here. Just pack your bags and go on. And that's the way it should be. But this is Pocahontas County. You know, I've lived here all my life. I'm 61 years old. And I'm 100% for a dog that's on another man's property, disturbing his stock, anything. Yes, yeah, something should be done. But this thing here, the way it's run up, to me, it's ridiculous. That's all i got to say. Thank you, Mr. Walker. That concludes the...